International Dress Day. Uh, it's an annual tradition as part of the UN Human Rights Council. It feels very special. It's fantastic. It brings additional flavor to the whole council, I think. And it's also a great icebreaker to talk to people you don't normally talk to. So it's good to remember a bit where you come from. If you come to the National Dress Day, you really see the diversity of the people. Whatever your size are, whatever your tall or small are, you can fit into one kimono. And we have a sake bottle, also wearing national costume of Japan. That's a traditional dress, a lot of cows in Appenzell, and they use it specially in spring when they pick the cows up to the Alps. So this is uh, cheese diplomacy since we're in Geneva, in Switzerland, another home of cheese. Wisconsin's also famous for its cheese. He tratado de vestirme como una mujer shipiva de la Amazonía peruana. Por ejemplo, esta bolsa, esta falda. Son muchos collares. Soy de El Salvador y estoy, uh, estoy vistiendo el vestido típico de El Salvador. Today I'm wearing our traditional dress that is uh, coming from Cameroon, particularly from the northwest region of Cameroon. And you have elephants, you have birds. Je pense que c'est une bonne chose que les Nations Unies pensent aussi euh, à la culture. C'est ça aussi qui fait les Nations Unies. We are the delegation of the Netherlands uh, here, representing uh, our uh, national dresses as well as our paintings. So this painting is uh, The Milkmaid by Johannes Vermeer. And uh, of course my dress today is supposed to be a depiction of the milkmaid. Okay. The custom comes from Iran. Iran is a multinational country. We have uh, lots of different nationalities living there all together. The one that I am wearing is Kurdish dress. <laughs>